Oh, Kevin Reese has been following this story all day long for us and joins us live from Balt Springs now. Kevin, what have we been able to learn? Well, although Gray Elementary uh, is a Mesquite ISD school, we are in Balch Springs, and this is a Balch Springs police investigation, and here is what we do know so far. They tell us that the body was found here in a grassy area at the school early this morning. Investigators, as you were talking about, sectioned off a triangle area around the Gray Elementary School sign and reader board at the very front of the school in view of parents and students as they arrived this morning. Two evidence markers could be seen in the grass. That body first discovered at about 741 this morning. But then after investigators removed the body, they could be seen extending more crime scene tape at the very back of the school surrounding that playground. Late this afternoon, police confirmed the victim is a juvenile male, but that foul play is not suspected, cause of death still pending. Parents who I spoke with this afternoon say the school alerted them that the victim is believed to be a 16-year-old boy. School continued as normal. The district telling us the schedule was not affected. Parents returned to pick up their kids at about 325 this afternoon. However, early this afternoon, we watched as a woman arrived at the front parking lot and had a very animated, very emotional conversation with detectives. Who that person is, we don't yet let know, but here's what some other parents told us this afternoon. Mom, it's scary because my kids walk to school every morning, so, um, so it is unfortunate, especially for the family that's going to have to bury their baby. Balch Springs police tell us they have not released an, an identity or a cause of death, but again, they have been told or we they have told us that foul play is not suspected. But a lot of people, including all of the parents that were here this afternoon waiting for answers, a lot of questions, a lot of concerns about what did happen here either overnight or early this morning. Jason. All right, Kevin, thank you for the uh, update out there.